I, in my mind, when I think about who owns a Kudu, I see this tremendously large range of folks. And there are a lot of competitors on the market who make super cool boutique grills who, who do a great job. And people say, but would that guy, like he already has this, why would he buy a Kudu? My opinion is that he might have them both. I think that there are people who will get rid of their gas grills to get a Kudu. I think there are people who will get rid of their previous charcoal grill to get a Kudu. And I actually think there's a lot of folks who will keep that gas grill and they'll keep their other charcoal grill. They'll keep their, you know, Kamado egg shaped grill and they'll buy this because they'll realize that this gives them an opportunity from an entertaining point of view. It's an entirely different ball game. Imagine, if you were, that you're going to a tailgate. You know, I love football. I think football season is one of the best times of the year to get out the grill and go to town. But I can't load, you know, the Weber into the back of my car. I can't, certainly can't fit my big green egg back there. But the Kudu breaks down in a way that I can literally put it in the back of my vehicle, take it to the game, pop it up, and I have a real cooking system where maybe I'm grilling wings and cooking brats at the same exact time. And I don't mean grilling both of them, I mean, you know, cooking brats in a pan full of beer and barbecuing chicken wings at the same time. Two completely different temperatures, two completely different styles of food, one cooking apparatus. You know, or by that same token, it's Thanksgiving and you have family and friends over and your wife is telling you there is no more room inside the house to cook anything. And you go, let me go outside, I'll do it on the kudu. And if you had said before, like, oh, I'll go throw it on the grill, she would have gone, you have lost your mind. But now, I mean, you could cook a whole big chicken. You could cook two whole chickens. You could cook a turkey. You could roast vegetables. And you could make a pan of stuffing all on the kudu in one failed swoop. And I mean, I just think about something like that, and it makes me excited. I don't know any other grilling system that I would be comfortable putting a pan of hot oil on and making french fries, but I could do it on the kudu. I could do it easily on the kudu, and when I'm done cooking them, with the effort of moving some, a spatula, I could swing it out and allow it to cool down safely. And I think that's what makes it so uniquely different. 